Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video i am going to do an in depth review of the latest table oxygen 13 for the oneplus 9 series so without wasting any more time let's get started so it has been a week since oneplus rolled out table oxygen 13 for the oneplus 9 series and since then i have been using it on my device in this video i'm going to cover everything about this build the performance the battery backup the charging and will also share some of the sample shot to see if there are any improvements on the camera If I go into the about info section, the device is running the latest stable update of Oxygen 13. The build number is F.16 and the security patch is of 5th October 2022. The overall performance has been just great and I have not faced any bugs or lags in the day-to-day -day tasks. Now that I have been using it for over a week now, I don't have any complaints regarding the stability part as such. The ROM just flies through pretty much everything without any issues. It is fast, snappy, the animations are really good particularly and the device just feels smooth and fluid. If we talk about the battery backup So here you can see I've got almost more than 3 hours of screen on time since last charge. Most of the time I was streaming content on Netflix and surfing through other social media websites and my OnePlus 9 Pro still have 44% battery left. So no issues regarding battery backup. On average I'm getting 5 to 6 hours of screen on time which is kind of pretty good. If I talk about the charging speeds the charging speeds are also fine and I'm able to warp charge my device. It takes almost around 40 to 45 minutes to charge my device from 1 to 100%. So no issues in charging speeds also. Coming up with the camera so here i have clicked some sample shots after i updated the device and as you can see that i have not encountered any major changes regarding the camera quality the pictures are sharp and the colors are vibrant but it is almost same as it was on oxygen os 12 i have seen many users reported that there are jitter issues while recording 8k video on the device and here you can see i have recorded a video in 8k and i did face this issue while recording the video one plus fixes issue on oxygen os 12.1 but this has started occurring again if we talk about gaming you can play till 60 fps in bgmi there is no support for 90 fps and if you are a serious gamer and want to do gaming you will need to install a custom rom or install oxygen os 11 apart from that there are still some heating issues with snapdragon 888 processor i mean the device start heating up after only one game and kind of gets unbearable after one hour so the heating issues are still there in gaming but have been kind of resolved in the general day to day task so guys this was the in depth review of oxygen os 13 stable update for the oneplus 9 series overall the build is too stable and smooth than the beta builds and it can be used as a daily driver without any issues comment down your opinions regarding the oxygen os 13 if you are facing any problems subscribe to the channel for more tech videos thank you for watching